Hey guys, welcome back to Matem. This is Mike7493 or Mike or whatever the heck you want to call me. Um, we had a perfect flood. Looks like we're going to have another perfect flood. Last week, we just let the town do its thing and that really paid off with the housing and kind of getting the economy straight. Looks like this episode we're just going to have to let things run its course once again to allow for this to take it to do its thing now I'd like for this to go quicker and there's a bunch of factors that go into building this you need the you need the wood people to build the ramps we're not having a problem with that the wood people are building the ramps and that's how, and that's getting done the second thing you have to do is you have to have the brick layers guy the stone I think the carpenters guild and stone masons guild these are the people that I believe these are the people that are out here standing right now. My stonework yes. will endure through the They're ages. the ones that lay the bricks. And then you also need you need the supply of the bricks. And then you need the peasants. They're the ones that work the fields during one season and then carry the bricks to the monument another season. So the peasants are the ones that seem to be slowing things up. And now you have work camps. I have plenty of work camps to outweigh They seem to... That'll go back up really quick. Um, the peasants are the ones that carry it, and I feel like right now they are not the ones carrying it, per se. So, I mean, they're, they're the ones that slow on this monument process up. So that would mean that I have plenty of stonemasons, but I guess I could use some more. So I'm gonna build a couple more of couple more because Coach Ev recommended that I do that. So I'm going to just to build more. Yeah. I don't know why we're having such a trouble with keeping the right amount of people up for uh for labor. But anyways. This episode, the next episode, will be a little bit like 10 to 15 minutes, and I'm just going to let it run. And probably should do that now. I mean, because this is just taking forever. Okay, they seem to have a pretty constant flow now. God, this is going to take ages to get all the way up to the point. I'm just gonna let it run because we're actually having a pretty steady flow. Look at that. Bloop, bloop, bloop. I should be able to send that. Correct, I can. Almost halfway finished with this thing, which is nice. So hopefully we don't have too much longer of this left because this map is ready to be beaten. We just gotta finish this monument. You guys said you wanted to see it all, so I'm gonna just let it do its. Just gonna let it, you know, go. Well, I guess I can talk about a couple things while this runs. I just posted up a Tornado Survival Series epi uh, episode. That just talks about, like, my channel plans with that series and with everything else. If you want to watch it, just to kind of figure out what's going on in my channel, if you're not watching that, I'd recommend watching that. Second thing, E3 has officially ended. I am completely and utterly disappointed at everybody's performance at E3. Sony, Nintendo, Microsoft, everybody. Like, it was crappy. There wasn't anything that I saw that I'm like, ooh, I want that game now, or rather, I want to buy the system to get that game. Or I was impressed with the system. And I can go into a rant on that, but I think I'm going to start with some other things first. So, go watch that video if you want to see an update on my channel. Um... There is... I guess I'll go ahead and talk about E3's Nintendo stuff. It was... Oh crap, hang on one second, I'll be right back.
Okay, sorry about that. I'm gonna add that to one of my videos. I was it was processing, so I wasn't quite sure what to do. Okay. Where was I? E3. First of all, I'll talk about Sony Nint Sony Microsoft. Sony the PlayStation Vita, there's just nothing like crazy about it that I'm like dying about. Like I'm like, yay, great. Hey, we finished another level. And there's nothing from Microsoft, like with their new thing that they're trying to copy and like jip Nintendo from with the like tablet thing. It just it was like the delay and stuff, I was just not interested. There wasn't any games that interested me. Probably you guys are gonna rage at me before that, but that's alright, right? Secondly, I will go to Nintendo, because that is the one that I really did just pay attention to, because I'm a Nintendo fanboy. <sighs> 3DS, Nintendo absolutely neglected this, the 3DS. There is... All the games are crap coming to it, except for Paper Mario, but that doesn't really interest me, and that's the, I don't see Paper Mario as a game that's going to make people go out and buy the 3DS to play that game. That's just something where it's like, great, I might go buy that game because I already have a 3DS and there's nothing else to play for my 3DS. That's the only reason I'd go buy Paper Mario. Second game is Luigi's Mansion. Now, that is a game that people might go out and buy a 3DS to play, only for the nostalgia. There wasn't, I mean, the game just, I mean, the game looks fun. Don't get me wrong, I loved... Luigi's Mansion. That's probably the only thing, the only game at Nintendo that announced for the 3DS that I was like, that might actually do something for Nintendo. So I'm actually looking forward to that, I'd have to say. I probably need to start importing some food. Can I import? I can't import any other. Oh, I can import fish. Let's just import and keep it at. Let's just go to 1,000. See how this works out. I'll let that start importing for a bit, and then we'll um put it in some of the storage yards, some of the granaries. All right, and so that was really the only game to me that seemed that way. I was completely shocked that Animal Crossing was not announced, and to me, it wasn't even on the 2012. I was pissed, and so was the other million people out there that are on Animal Crossing Community and all the other Animal Crossing and Nintendo forums. They were raging that there was no Animal Crossing. What the heck? It was announced at E3 2010. And last year, the game looked like it was pretty well, like, it looked like it was pretty well established. Like, we knew a lot about it. They're just not talking about it. It's like they're saving it for a later date. And I understand that, but you wasted your time on New Super Mario Bros. 2. It's just a crappy another Mario game that ever, nobody cares about. Like, there's so much Mario games out there. Do we really just need another one with new levels? Like... Send out something that are going to get people to go out and buy a 3DS to play the game. And that would be Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing is one of those games. And to me, they are just not... Nintendo is almost frustrating me because their marketing for the 3DS and what they're doing to the company as itself, farther game-wise, and what they're, like how they're trying to market things, it's just not working, and it's not the way I would do it. And, I don't know. They could do things differently. Anyways. So I am pissed at Animal Crossing. Is Animal Crossing even coming out in 2013? It wasn't on the 2012 list. And it's supposed to come out in fall in Japan, so maybe it's just coming out in Japan and they're delaying it for America. I don't know why. But the 3 I just don't want the 3DS to end up. I just don't want the 3DS to end up like the Virtual Boy. <sighs> Where everything just fails and Nintendo gives up on it. Because that's almost like what it's doing. They didn't care at all about it. And I understand they're trying to market the, the, the Wii U too, but... The Wii U, okay, the Wii U looks like a cool system. The only reason I might have the slightest interest in buying it, if it's like $250, $200, I would buy it, is Pikmin 3. But all the other games are just the same things that are on Xbox and PlayStation, except for Nintendo Land, maybe. Nintendo Land looks sort of interesting. Like, I mean, Nintendo's own private games, that's the only thing that's going to make it interesting. And... I need to start slowing down time in a minute here. Put on the key just in case. Um, 
This level's almost done. Wow, we're making some progress. Yay. Yeah, increase. Great. It doesn't affect me. Alright, let's go over and check all of... Oh, wow, that all upgraded. Sweet. Let's go ahead and send our military up, because I'm pretty sure they're going to attack right here again. I'll send... I'll keep this one right in here for now. Alright, so let's let this run its course. Wow, this really upgraded. Nice. Liking the way this is looking. Great, they invaded up there again. Makes it easy. No! Where'd the other army go? They walk on the outside and it gets really confusing to me. Oh my gosh! Where did it go? Where'd my army go? the F? Where'd you guys go? Literally, where is my other flak? Way to fail. Way to fail, guys. That was like crap job on your part. Whatever. My god, where did my other army even go? Okay. Whatever. Alright, these are all just houses, right? Potter, woodcutter. No, they weren't just houses. Potter. Woodcutter. Storage yard, storage yard, and those were houses. Okay, there we go. Both of these people, are, they like disappeared behind that. Interesting. Alright. Let me go ahead and do a lavish festival and save. Alright. As I was saying, I'm kind of shocked that of all the games, Nintendo picked Animal Crossing as one to not continue to make progress on and work on it because as me that just seems like a poor marketing idea because that is one of the most anticipated games for the 3ds and has one of the biggest fan bases out there right now waiting for it so i don't know what nintendo's doing who freaking knows they're just failing as a company right now and their conferences were so cheesy and scripted and the people were nervous that were up there i'm like dude i would go up there and totally make a better performance than you guys like their presence and there's people should be ready for speaking like they couldn't even like they're messing up all the time especially for the 3ds one i was like this is really lame who the heck is coming over right now all right hang on i'll be right back okay back sorry about that i'm one of my sister's friends um as i was saying yeah animal crossing i don't know why i'm very disappointed it's been two years we've had to wait already like might as well not announce anything but they've announced i showed pictures they've shown in english and japanese and that shows the fact that the game is very far along why it's not continuing to be worked on and why it's not finished i don't understand so whatever why is my population just decreasing why are these people leaving who knows whatever we're almost done with this <laughs> Um, so yeah, as far as the Wii U goes, like I was saying, there's nothing about it that to me makes me want to go out and spend 350 to $400 to buy it. There's nothing that makes me want to do that. Pikmin 3, yes, that's going to be a great game. There's going to be some cool games on it, but most of them, except for the Nintendo branded ones, you can play on F. Um... Don't tell me, oh, here comes the music. This is when everything's gonna collapse and my whole town is gonna end up burning down. So, we'll see how things roll, but I am kind of disappointed with the whole Animal Crossing thing. Actually, I'm pissed. And I don't understand why... 
I don't understand what Nintendo's trying to do with that. That's all I'm saying. So. Yeah. Ether was disappointing. Nothing, nothing new. Nothing we didn't really know was coming. There wasn't any crazy things exciting. And I really look forward to seeing those. All those things that. That you look forward to. And that are. You know, something that's interesting. So. Who knows. I don't know what Nintendo's doing right now. I don't under I don't I really don't. I don't think anybody have won I don't think any of them deserved winning E3, so Oh well. Oh sorry about that, my video was done compressing. If anything, <laughs> the third party gamers like Ubisoft stuff, they're the ones that won it. As bad as like I wanna say that they're the company that won, those kind of companies won because like Konami and stuff, they were designing so they were they announced these third party companies announced so many games. So many games that are coming to all these different systems. And that's really great for the other companies. But the actual companies themselves didn't really have anything to show off. Where's the burning building? I guess I could put a firehouse somewhere. Alright, Lavish Festival. Alright. We're almost... Oh yeah, we started a whole new level now. Wow. This is making progress now. How far into it is it now? 62. We went from 40... Something... 42, something like that, to 62. So I'll accept that. As I continue my rant. So right now, I'm personally not going to go out and buy a Wii U. And if you haven't bought a 3DS, I would not recommend buying a 3DS because right now there's nothing to do on the 3DS. Unless you are like a hardcore Mario can fan or Super Mario Land and just are dying for a new Super Mario to play. There's really nothing that's like worth it right now. Or I mean Ocarina of Time. That's probably the only game that if you're a crazy Zelda and would like to replay the game, get it. But otherwise it's not worth it. Wait until there's something good that comes out. Um... What else? I think that's about my it for my rant for E3. Again, completely pissed off and shocked that there is no Animal Crossing. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you guys. I don't know why it's not there. I don't know what they're planning to do. It was supposed to be 2011. It was supposed to be t summer 2012. It was moved to fall 2012 in Japan, and now it doesn't look like 2012 at all. So, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. On a completely different note, okay, that's fine. Population is dropping, people are leaving town. So, that's it for my rant on E3. E3 sucked. I'm pissed at Nintendo for releasing no Animal Crossing stuff. I know I sound like a spoiled brat, but it's been two years and you've spoiled us and teased us enough. Now, when is the game coming out? If it's canceled or delayed, tell us. Don't just <clears throat> ignore it. They would sell, the 3DS sales would skyrocket if they released Animal Crossing 3DS. That is honestly why I bought my 3DS on release day, because I was hoping that it was going to come out very soon and we were all wrong. I was wrong. And I wasted two hundred fifty dollars because two month, couple months later they dropped the price by eighty. Oh crap! Where's the fire? All right. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video. So I'm going to talk to you guys later. See ya.